what you're going to need for this session. So the first thing that you are going to have to do is chill your martini glass. So we're going to put that in a fridge. Next up, we are going to make our espresso mix. So take 50 mils of hot water and that is hot. It's hurting my fingers, I'm not going to lie. And your granules that came with your garnish pack. Add in. <laughs> Add in your uh, hot water and just give that a little mix with a spoon. I'm sure you've got one in your house. You don't need a special spoon. This is a bar spoon. It's really long. You're just going to mix that up. And now that's ready. Grab your Boston glass. Into your Boston glass, add 25 ml of coffee liqueur. Then we're gonna add 25 ml of vodka. You remember the um, espresso mix from earlier that we made? We're gonna use that now. So 50 ml of espresso mix into the glass. Last but not least, we're gonna use the salted caramel syrup. So we're just gonna add that into the glass too. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our Boston syrup. We're going to fill that with cube dice, fill up the glass with cube dice, and then we're going to give it a shake. Now you need to shake this one very, very, very hard. Because the harder you shake it, the fluffier it gets. And it becomes a lot more creamy. First things first, we get our chilled martini glass. We release the tin from the glass. And then again, we're gonna double strain this one. So now to garnish, what we're gonna do is just create a nice little triangle effect with the coffee beans supplied in your garnish bag. Stanley, do the honors, Arquette. 